Okay, in this video I'll be using some data about the 2004 SAT tests and I'll have one variable is just the states then there's the participation rate which went from 5% to about 87% then there's the verbal scores and then the math scores. Okay, so now we'll get the correlation between participation looks like the higher the participation rate the lower the verbal score what that means is if you have a very low participation rate then only the very brightest students are taking the test so the more you have participating the more likely it is that you will include students other than your brightest just to get a plot now go back here and change that to just plot and now you have a scatter plot here paste in some code to get a scatter plot here we go and what you'll see in my code is I have plot participation comma verbal if I had just closed the parentheses right then, I would have had a plot, uh, just a basic scatter plot. Then I put frame plot equal false. I didn't want to frame around my plot. Then I put the main title, the label for the x axis, the label for the y axis. Then an AB line is just going to be a line that's based on LM stands for linear model, verbal as a function of participation. So that's going to give me the line for that linear model, just a least squares line. Okay, one more thing I want to do while I'm here, and that is just paste in, it's just L, that can be any letter, is equal to LM for linear model, verbal is a function of participation, then summarize L. And you can see down here I have the intercept is 575.4 with a slope of minus 1.01 .01. that means as the participation goes up by one that really is from zero to one or to a hundred percent your score goes down 101 points so we started off around 575 if we were at zero and then had we had it full 100% participation the score would have gone down by a little over 100 points again what that means is that if you have very few people participating you have maybe the top 5 or 10% of the state those scores are going to be higher than in states where you have a lot higher participation rate because now no longer just the top 10% students in the state that are participating 